person who knows dirt better than, well, all of us. Yeah, pretty much. We're talking about a friendship that began 19 years ago. Mark Cuban shares some of his favorite memories with our Jonah Javad. The series is over. The Mavericks have scaled the NBA playoff mountain and have planted their flag. They are the NBA champions for 2010. If you work hard enough and care enough, anything is possible. And Dirk, you made so many anythings possible for me and the city. Few people know Dirk Nowitzki better than Mark Cuban. Dirk was drafted by the Dallas Mavericks in 1998. Cuban bought the team less than two years later. What do you remember about y'all's first encounter? Well, my first encounter um, with Dirk was the night before I, I announced, not before I met the team after I bought the team. <laughs> and we were at the old Star Club. I was with my buddy celebrating, right? Just being stupid. I mean, stupid. I, we were tearing it up. And um, Steven and, and Dirk were there. And I'm like, I gotta walk up to him. And I walk in, hey guys, can I buy you a beer? No, I'm just, you know, th they're just thinking I'm some idiot fan, right? Well, I'll see you tomorrow. Next day I come in, standing up there, and they're like, what the? <laughs> Dirk and Cuban have spent the last 19 years together, forming one of the closest owner-player bonds in basketball history. When you're sitting next to him at, at a blackjack table, and, and there could be anybody. I mean, I've been to Vegas countless times with them, and there could be just be anybody just sitting at the table, and he'll pull up. Okay, this is the spot. Bam, bam, bam. We sit there, and there'll be two, three other people already there. What's up? And like they're they're long lost friends, and just you know, the people are like, oh, okay. And we'll, he'll just sit there and drink and gamble with all of us for 12 straight hours, and and that's just who he is. <laughs> Genuine but goofy. Goofy's an understatement. I mean, I've been kicked out of restaurants with him. Um, for what? <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. For Cuban, the laughter and memories flow like wine. As Dirk closes the chapter on his 21st and likely his final NBA season. I don't expect him to play longer. I mean, he's, you know, knowing Dirk, if he would have said, it was, I'm retiring, he didn't want the whole Dwayne Wade type thing, you know, and make it a tour and, and do this, because that's just not Dirk. He, it's not like, he's not a look at me guy. You know, he's the guy going to the hospitals and playing with the kids and spending extra time with them and, and volunteering and doing when the cameras aren't off the same thing he does when the cameras are on. And all the cameras will be on Wednesday night, shining bright on number 41 as Dirk and the Mavs visit the San Antonio Spurs in the season finale. In Dallas, I'm Jonah Javad.